back. Um, you are on part, hang on, what am I? Oh, part four of my batch film marathon. Um, and for those of you who are with me, and if you're thinking, wait, hang on, wasn't she wearing that in the last video? Yes, yes I was. And also, this is the same cup of coffee. Hang on, one second. It's so nearly cold. Anyway, look what I've got. I'm so excited. You have no idea how excited I am to get this done. I set this up yesterday. Was it yesterday? Yeah, I set this up yesterday and I took it out with me last night and it's been out with me today. I've been itching to write on it, but I wanted to give you like a pristine kind of glimpse of um, of how it all looked. Um, so, oh, I've wanted one of these for ages. Look how small it is. Look, a cup of coffee, planner. Look, oh, it's so cute. Hang on, hand for comparison. It's like hand-sized. Oh, love it. Right, hang on. Let me just take my cards out. It's like a working thing. <laughs> right, hang on. Get my dodgy driver's license and my dodgy photo out of the way. Ooh. Right, okay, done. And I even bought myself a new pen to go with it. Any excuse. Oh, sorry, I can't wait a minute. Right, bye bye boring pen. Hello, nice pen. Right. Oh, shall we go in? Oh. Oh. I just, do you know what? I had this for Christmas. I had this for Christmas. It is almost February. That's just tragic. You know what is more tragic than that? This is where you keep your money. I have a receipt. One note. How lonely that looks in there. Anyway. <laughs> Um, I love the idea of this though. I just, I really think that, look, oh, I'm so rich. <laughs> anyway, sorry. Um, <laughs> I just love the idea that you can use this as an actual wallet. This is not my only planner. I'm not new to this planner game. Um, I'm using this alongside, if you haven't seen it already, um, my Molden personal size. I'm also itching to get my A5 on the go as well. Juggle the whole three of them, you know how it works. Um, but anyway, so this is going to be in my bag the whole time. That took some thought. Um, basically, what I wanted to carry around with me because I didn't want it to be too full, and it's kind of not. But bear in mind, this is how full it is, and I've got monthly dividers in here, and there's room. Look, now these rings. Can you see how big those are? They're quite small. Look finger sized um that's a technical measurement look how big are they i don't know but enough to get your finger in <laughs> so, you'll get used to my british sense of humor um so anyway yeah it's not full it's kind of at the stage where when you open the rings it does kind of pop out a little bit but you can turn the pages um but for me the most important thing was that i have these monthly dividers in there because this is my primary source of dates um, so I've got the obligatory um, inbox thing because you know by now I am such a fan of the inbox. This is the I want to put something in here but I am too busy to find the page. That's what this section is all about for me. Um, and you'll notice as well um, when I was setting up my moulding, oh it's such fun, just decorating it with like everything. This is functional. This is like I am out and about, I am at the hairdressers, I, you don't want to be getting your washi tape out of the hairdressers. You would get looks. Um, so <laughs> this is not that kind of thing. Um, but I did want, as I said, these monthly pages. Now, this is teeny. Look, this is really, really small. Um, so for a start, the monthly pages in here, um, they're a lot thinner than my normal ones. They're really, really thin. I've actually got these um, with my laminate um, cover. Um, what was I saying? Oh my god, it's just gone. <laughs> what was I saying? Yes, I've got these um, made of paper with my regular laminate cover um, because it's just that much thinner. But to be fair, really, you'd never know. They feel really nice. 
quite taken with those. Um, and I wanted to have um, seasonal stuff again. I don't know if you've seen my seasonal ones. Hang on, I just remembered my copy. I don't know if you've seen my seasonal ones on Etsy, but oh my God, I sell so many of those, but I wanted like a neutral one. So I've got more of a neutral theme going on. Um, next to January is blank because I did not make it in time. <laughs> Anyway, moving on. Um, so we'll start off then by looking at what I've got in each one of these sections. So I'm imagining when I'm filling this in, it is when I'm out for a coffee, making plans, getting stuff out of my head, or I am sitting in the car, waiting outside my little girl's school, or I'm at a kid's party and they tell me there's another party coming up and I just want to write it down or I'm out and about and I just think I need to buy a load of stuff and I don't want to have it in my head and I can just make a note. That's what this is for. Um, so I've got um, a month overview, but I wasn't really intending to write anything on here. Um, I can, don't get me wrong, but I'm thinking stickers. I know I said I did not want to be getting my washi tape out, but look how cute these are. Um, so I made myself some teeny little icon stickers to go with these. I am just in love with these. I drew these out on the iPad. And the nice thing is when you draw things out on the iPad and you think, well, that's a bit wonky. I'm not too keen on that. But you make it really, really small. You can't tell. And it actually looks really cute. <laughs> They're so sweet. Anyway, so I've got ones for um, doctor's appointments, prescriptions, coffee, restaurants, shopping, haircut, and parties for birthdays for kids. That's basically my life in a nutshell. Um, and then I've got some um, some of these little dot stickers. If you watch my AliExpress video, these are my really cheap ones. Oh, they're so nice. Um, anyway, so that goes on my month page. And then... Events and appointments, because you're not going to be writing much down on there, are you, really? Not unless your writing is teeny. Um, so here I've got a space for the date and then what it is. Birthdays. Oh, my God, there are so many birthday parties. Those of you with kids, do you notice that every weekend there is like another birthday party? Um, I can't keep up, but now... I will do. Um, and tasks as well, like random bits and pieces that you just think about when you're out and about. Um, and a space for notes, because that's always useful. Um, and space for reminders. And to purchase. Um, just like random bits and pieces to buy, obviously. Um, so I've just got the same in every month. And that's kind of all I need, isn't it? really um and then at the end of the monthly section i've got oh hang on mm, i just remembered i didn't do these okay hang on wait i gotta test this out oh this is in the wrong place oh right, cut that out okay. right so i made these dividers to go and separate the back bit up so i've got one for um for food one for tasks and one for notes. Um, but I wanted to be able to, um, excuse me a minute. I wanted to be able to see what they were. So I've been testing out some, can you see those? I foiled. I've been testing out some, um, some stickers. Um, do you know what? Now I look at it, I think I prefer the silver. Is that going to look okay on that, do we reckon? I'm going to test it out. Anyway, I didn't want to print out the titles on here, so I thought I might use some of these stickers. But these are my 30 millimeter ones. Are they just going to be too big for that, look? I need my smaller ones. Right, I'm going to dig those out. But actually, yeah, I think I like the silver. I've done these in the same font, so it matches up and makes me feel really happy. So what have I got? I've got food, food. Food and tasks and notes. Yeah, okay. So if I dig out my 20 millimetres, I'm sorted. Right, I will do that later. All right, watch this space. Anyway, um, and again, really thin. Um, so I've got my shopping list here to go with my meal planners because normally I'm just grocery shopping but having a coffee before the grocery shopping, which is when this happens. Um, and I thought that when I'm out, Oh, that is just perfect size, isn't it? 
I want to feel so fancy walking around the supermarket with my fancy little file effects. Oh, so nice. Um, so then I've got my tasks at the back, more of those, and just some space for notes because again, always useful. Um, and then my little bits at the back, um, I've got random receipts um, that I might need. And look, I've got extra space for stuff. These annoyingly are a little bit snug, but maybe they'll get very well used. And my lonely ten pound note. Oh, maybe it'll multiply. Who knows? Um, and more pockets at the front. So I quite like that. I didn't know whether to um, have a different dashboard. I've got so many things. Um, I guess I'm probably just gonna change them up a little bit every now and again. Mm, depends what kind of feel I want, I suppose, but, oh, you know me and my coffee. I just, I think that, you know, when you've got, like, a really nice front page in your planner, it just, you open it up and you just want to use it because it just looks nice. Strong, strong like your coffee. Mm, well, I'm sticking with that one, anyway. The other thing that I was wondering about... Um, was I did these little inserts for it because I thought, oh, you know, black and blush and grid mm, all over that. Um, but then I just thought, I don't know if this is how I'm going to use it, which is a shame because these took me ages, but I don't think I'm going to use them. So you tend to use teeny tiny ones for weekly planning. Um, does anyone do that? I don't know. If that's you, then let me know in the comments below. Um, I don't know. I know that some of you um, have been asking to see this because you're kind of intrigued about the whole pocket size thing. Um, but for me, this just seems like a natural way to do it. You know, just like having like such little space. You just want to get down the bare minimum. Um, kind of, that's it. I don't know. So I'm going to see if this works anyway. Um, hopefully, hopefully it'll be good. Um, and also, my pen, why love my pen so much? Right, okay. All right, since you've stayed to the end, shall I show you what's making me really happy? Do you want to see? It's really bad. Oh my God. Okay, look. So, this. Did you hear that? <laughs> you have no idea how happy this makes me. It's a sellotape dispenser. It's a really heavy, dirt cheap, Amazon special <laughs> tape dispenser. I'm so excited about it, you guys. <laughs> I don't know what running a planning business has done to me that this is the highlight of my day, but it is. How tragic is that? Is anyone else like really into their stationery? It's so curvy, like you can practically hug it. I love it. Anyway, um, right before, um, before I go, completely bonkers um, and take a moment <laughs> to appreciate my cold coffee. Um, I think I'm gonna go. This, as I said, is my fourth video I'm doing in a row. Um, I also have another AliExpress video to do. I might do that tomorrow. Who knows? I don't be in my 5 a.m. slot. If you see me and this has changed and instead of this, it's pajamas. You know that's what I've done. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Um, please subscribe if, if you're not already. If you have, I hope this has not put you off. Um, and click the bell so you don't miss anything coming up. Um, if you see anyone that wants to try out this whole pocket business, um, share it with them as well. Um, and above all else, if you do like this, hit the like. Because I don't know how many people actually use pocket size planners. I thought it was all personal, but... Who knows? If you like this, I will do more of this. Anyway, thank you. Bye.